Hello fellow migrants and Indians abroad. Today we are going to dive into one of the biggest concerns when working in a foreign country. How do we send our hard earned money home? Well my friends, in this video I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. Back in 2011 when I first started sending money home, I was stuck using SBI and I thought I was doing the right thing. Using a bank felt safe, they are familiar, reliable and trustworthy. At least that's what I thought. I discovered that using a bank meant I was paying hefty fees and losing a lot of money in unnecessary charges. Fortunately, there's a better way. Monito.com is a free website where you can enter your transfer details and they'll tell you who the cheapest and best provider will be. It has options for bank transfers, cash pickups, mobile wallets, and even debit cards. So no matter how you want to send your money home, you're covered. Let's say you need to send money to a bank account in India. You just have to go on to Monito.com, select the country you live in, and then India, and enter how much you want to send. And if you click compare, Monito then gives you a whole list of providers that you can use for your transfer. It's actually really helpful. They tell you exactly how long it will take, the fee, and rate for the transfer. And most importantly, exactly how much your family will receive. They also include any deals that are available, which I love. These also change quite often. So I always make sure to come back every time I make a transfer. Now you might be thinking, Ranjit, what about if I want to send money from India to another country? Well, don't worry. You can also use Monito for that as well. In fact, my friend that's a student in UK, he sends money to his university from India. And through Monito, he discovered a company called Remit Out and another one called Vice. Vice is usually his go-to, but he always checks Monito before because the best provider can change. I'll put a link in the description box below for Monito. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments and stay tuned for more videos about managing your finances abroad as an NRI. Goodbye.